XML files are an extremely useful resource for sports performance analysis. They allow you to share your data in a format which can be read by other sports video analysis programs, even if they're on a completely different operating system. This means that multiple analysts can work on the same analysis independent of each other, before sharing and compiling their work at the end of the process. In this video, we'll show you how to export your work to XML and also how to import these files into Naxport and how to sync them to your own analysis. There are two places from where you can export your analysis to XML. Firstly, for the My Analysis area. You can export the whole analysis or multiple analyses together. The second option is Access from the Timeline and allows for a more customised export. Click on this icon and choose the XML option which suits you best. This window now opens, which allows you to select or deselect the categories and descriptors you need. If you have a graphic descriptor on your analysis, you can check this box to include the coordinate data in your exported analysis. For more information on graphic descriptors, please check the link in the description. Let's talk about importing XML files into Naxport. From the main menu, go to the Options menu, select Tools, Import and Import XML File. Now click here and locate your XML file. Accept and this window opens which allows you to customise your import. Select the categories that interest you. In this example, we only want to see the data for shots, rebounds, fouls and free throws. If you want the full analysis, all categories and descriptors are selected by default. Click Import and select the location where you want to save your imported data. We mention this as you may want to save the file in the same folder where all your Naxport analyses are stored. By default, this is the MyDBs file in the Naxport folder. At this point, it's important to mention that this process will create a Naxport specific .NAC file, the same format in which all your analyses will be saved. Accept and the import process will begin. As you can see, this is very quick, and when it finishes, you will end up with a .NAC file. The last step is to choose the video that you want to associate with the analysis. Click here, locate your video, and accept. You can now open the timeline to view your analysis by clicking here. You can import multiple XML files at the same time. This is extremely useful if you have a team of analysts working separately on the same game. Collect all the files together on one computer and repeat the import process, but this time hold control and click every file you want to import. Accept and continue as before. By doing this, you can have multiple analyses linked to the same video, as you can see here. In this example, we can open the data from the two XML analyses we've imported alongside the analysis that we have completed with Naxport. And that's it. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And to keep up to date with all the latest Naxport news, why not subscribe to the channel? Thanks and see you next time.